You need to talk to someone about why you keep putting yourself through this. No! Look, I'm fighting for some extra money. <laughs> Felix, I love you. But you know AJ, no one's gonna pay to watch you fight. That's what I am to everyone, isn't it? A joke. I didn't mean it like that. Look, I get a share of the gate receipts. It's a nice little earner. Now what? Are you calling Warren? Not only did I blame him for beating you up, but if the garage is in trouble, then it's as much his problem as it is yours. Sharon, stop. All right, look, this... This needs to remain between us. No mention of this to Mercedes, no mention of this to Warren. Please. Well, I need you to promise me that what happened between us last night was a one-off. It was. I mean it, Felix. This ends now. So you're not going to tell me what you were up to last night? You speak to Mercedes? What do you say? Don't worry. I covered for you and whatever it was you were up to last night. Again. And I appreciate that. I mean, something just came up last night. This something, it wouldn't have anything to do with Sharon, would it? Why would you say that? Well, it's just that she sneaked off last night. Said it was some emergency. But I haven't heard from her since. Oh, I thought I got bored of you. How cute. You get bored of me? Never. But calling time on whatever it is we've got going here, I'd do it in an instant if I thought you were mugging me off. No one's mugging you off, Warren. I had a genuine medical emergency. Didn't I, Felix? How would he know? Because that's who she was with last night. Am I right? Hmm. You and Felix look a little tired today, if you ask me. Uh, what are you going on about? Just that I overheard them talking in very hushed tones about keeping a secret from Mercedes and from you. I presume that this uh, secret is in relation to whatever it is you were up to last night. So you've been spying on us? <laughs> Don't make me into the bad guy here. Not when you're clearly cheating on my son with his best friend. You see what getting me to keep your secrets is doing? He's dragging me into your mess. Don't worry, Sharon. I'm going to fix it, all right? We'll do it, then. Warren, mate, it, it's not what you think, yeah? Do me a favour. I know it's exactly what I'm thinking. Wait, you take me for that kind of woman? With Felix? Give over. But I do take him to be the kind to, to get you to cover for his stupid mistakes. You told me that you'd stopped. Stopped what? It's your secret to tell me. Underground fighting. Really? Wow, I didn't see that one coming. Tell me more, Felix. This is serious, you know. So am I. Interrupt me again and I dare say you'll find out. Just stop it, will ya? We'll talk about this when we get home. That's exactly what I didn't want. Someone else knowing. It's your fault. If you'd have stopped, there'd be nothing for anyone to find out. He said he needed the money. Money? <laughs> Those fights paid peanuts. So you, you lied? Again? Why should we worry about you if you're not going to worry about yourself? Come on, let's get out of there. You're a liar and a thief. Your son's a killer. Tonight? Perfect. Yeah, I've just come from his uh, latest sparring session, and I'm positive he's the right man for our needs. I'll have to call you back. So you've managed to let yourself in again. Make yourself right at home. You're either very brave or very stupid. You know what I've got on you. Now a few other people know, and they want to put the squeeze on. Hmm. And how did they come to know about it, I wonder? 
flashing the cash, were you? Flaunting your newfound, ill-begotten wealth. You forget how many eyes and ears I have everywhere, Terry. Seems to me you've forgotten quite a few things over the years. Especially about loyalty and what happens to traitors. I owe you nothing. I've given half my life for you. Now I want another payment. Get these guys off me back and yours. <laughs> From where exactly? If memory serves, you absconded with all our money. You always said you were the brains of the outfit. Now have your chance to prove it. Tell you what, today's your lucky day. I may just have the perfect opportunity to generate some cash. And because of your special sacrifice for me, I'm gonna help you out one last time. But then we're done. For good. <laughs> so what, no fight tonight? Yeah, I'm done with all that. Felix, what do you take me for? I'm sure this isn't the first time you've said that. Yeah, but I mean it this time, all right? Because I can't risk anyone else finding out, especially not Mercedes. Oh, so that's what it's about. You're taking off the gloves because you don't want your woman to find out. Well, that's not a good enough reason. I mean, it's fine, but you've been fighting your whole life and it's the only thing you know. And you want someone else to feel your pain? You can stop for Mercedes all you want. It's not gonna make a difference unless you've dealt with your rage. I'm sorry, rage? Yes, rage. Until you deal with this properly, unless you speak to someone about why you want to beat people up, you're only going to go back and get another fix. <laughs> so you're making it sound like it's some kind of drug. So it's not. You wanting to go out there and harm other people is probably addictive. And just like any other drug, it can become dangerous. Well, you know what, like I said, Right? You don't need to worry about me because I'm going to stop. And once I do, I will open up. Mwah. All right. It's been good talking to you, all right? Felix uh, certainly seems to be able to take some punishment. Oh, I remember this loser. Hey, watch what you say. He's like a brother to Warren. And trust me, he's our route to a small fortune. <laughs> <laughs> okay, look. Are you gonna stop kissing me and actually fight me? Yeah? Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> You're bigger than that. Bring it. That's it. That's it. Two, three, three. Two. Please, please. You wanting to go out there and harm other people is probably addictive. It can become dangerous. <laughs> <laughs>